Well, how do there, charms to Zai, Captain of the Steves. And today, chums, for you guys in the universe, I'm back at it. Yeah, so we're going fishing. We're on the phase three now, though, people. So we're hammering along, I guess, and we're going to be going to do this one with the three whaleyman well faces on it. Golly out, right out. Well, let's jump in my ship. Let's jump on over into game and let's head on out, shall we, people? I guess. And it's just a case of warp jumping yet again isn't it so yeah step one fairly simple zoom oh we've got loads of asteroids though is it worth shooting a few to get a bit more tritium maybe maybe it is okay right well let's just get a little bit more tritium just to set us on our adventure yeah because it's a bit of a rarity some <laughs> on these expeditions i'm finding lots of area of space i don't know about you guys out there in the view of us where there's no asteroids i have to keep going to ringed planets anyway Let's, uh, let's get out of there. We've got a bit of tritium anyway. Cool. Oh, I'm already there. <laughs> ah, I'm already there. Okay, brilliant. Eh? Let's just spin it around then. And let's uh, hammer it down to the planet, people. I see you down at the planet. Come on. Well, I would do if um, there wasn't... Ow! Bloody asteroids. Okay, right. Well, this is a super cold planet by the looks of things. Or a cold planet of sorts. There is a future badge to catch some cold creatures i'm fairly sure but i don't know whether it's in this phase okay chance we're heading down to this rendezvous type point the secret fishing spot three and um i'm looking for cons balls to pop up and i was going to go for the first one and there's just freaking loads of cons balls around here so maybe it's just general proximity i'm just going to land on this tiny little island over here it looks like people have just picked through islands at random and slavered cons balls everywhere well, I don't think I'm going to be able to build a base around here, and I imagine other people already have. Right, so let's, uh, let's just set it down here for a second then. And yeah, there is there is a... Oh, great. There is a task to capture something like five uncommon water fish, and it's the last milestone in this. So, oh, 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 let's, let's uh, use my surveyor scanner thing. Well, that's that's odd. 900 U's that away. Okay. All right. Well, I guess we're going 900 U's that away then. Now, zoom. Right. I'll let you know. I guess when we get there. Eh? Okay. 900 U's this way now. I've also got a badge to go 50 U's under the water. And you can see here, this is quite shallow, isn't it? What I might do, go to the tray minute later, and just dig down. Let's make that nice and big. Let's see if we can dig down 50 U's underwater while we're on our way there. Probably not the best idea to do this right now, but go down as deep as we can. There we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I guess. Better get back up before I freaking drown, though, eh? Okay, we've done that one. There we go. Uh oh. Come on, let me out of this death trap of my own making. <laughs> oh, dear me. Okay, I'm not too fast. I just want oxygen, I guess. Right, let's get up out of here for a second. I should be okay, actually. I've got a reserve tank, haven't I? Okay, right, 500 views that way. I'll let you know when I get there, people. Okay, chums, well, I think I've made it. Yes, we have. It's some sort of monolith. Lovely. Okay, and all the, all the sound has gone squiffy yet again. Do I have to hit this up? Okay, free Hong Kong yet again. That's come up with twice now. Brilliant light erupts, blah, 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 blah. I think this is just normal stuff. I don't think this is part of fishing lore at all, to be fair. I'm just going to skip through that. It's not. It really isn't. Okay, so we've arrived located here. Of all places. Nice. Infantry is full. And I'm probably going to have to empty some of my inventory. So let's have a look at what we can do. <clears throat> we can pop that. I could release a couple of fishes. Or we could sell a couple of fishes. You know what I could do, actually? Thinking about it, people. Is I could bring out my skiff, couldn't I? Let's go into here. Sorry. I'm still getting used to understanding where the skiff actually is. There you go. Put that there. Then what I can do is all my fish, I can squirrel away into here until I'm ready to either sell them or do what I want with them, isn't it? So let's put all the fish in there. 
It'd be nice if there was just a button here to transfer all that were highlighted, you know? Because that's kind of tedious, isn't it? Having to do it one at a time like this. Okay, we've got all of our fishes in our little boxes. Little, little fishy in a little dishy when the boat comes in. I guess. Right. Now I think I'm ready to start my fishing again. We've already got some millworms on the old hookity hook. Let's start fishing. Plop! Okay, Monstaro. What the fudge? Yeah, it is quite, still quite hard to actually see what's going on fish-wise in storms like this. Because it's so hard to see the, the line. I can't be alone on this, can I? Okay, well, I've got a fish on. All I look at is, you see that spiral of water that comes out the top? As soon as it stays there for like about, you know, a fraction of a second, that's when I'm, I'm striking. It's, it's not much of a measure, to be fair. Okay, here we go, let's, let's go again. Chickaboom! Got a little fish here, on a little dish here, when a boat comes in... I'll catch another one, we'll pop, pop the badges. Yeah, okay, come on, come on little fishy. On a little dishy. Come on, you know you want to strike. So, no plumes of water coming up yet. Little plop of water. Little plop of water. Little plop of water. Um, come on. There we go. Big plume. There we are. And that's what I'm going by. I'm not looking at the line anymore. I'm looking at the plumes of water. Oh, great. Yeah. Night fishing. Poor free nocturnal fish. I don't even think that was... A, I didn't even realise that I was in night. Okay. Right, well, let's pop that then. We've got the Starship infantry slots at frickin' last. Yes, I need to put this... Oh, sorry, I've got to put this in technology. I've got a few technologies I need to apply in there. I'll put that over here, I think. And there. I'll put my last one there, please. Thank you. Oh, okay. Oh, and there's one. Sweet. At least we can get that done. Okay. Next one. Let's pop this one, then. Collect reward. Yes, we've got all of our underwater base building parts for doing that one. Sweet. So what's the one in between? What's the one I haven't done? This one. Dredge up a message of the angler. Okay, well we know how to do that. All we do is we take the bait off of the line. There we go, go into bait. Take the millworms off. And just cast out without anything. But let's make sure we've got an infantry slot free or something. So let's get this installed now. Aqua jets. Oh, my ship's too far away. One second. Let's see if we can call it to me. Yeah, so we can put it right behind me. Let's get that installed -ticated. Boom. Technology is already installed. Oh, okay. Well, that's been wasting the slot for some time then, hasn't it? Okay, well, let's get this in. We'll put that there, then. And uh, what else have we got? we got that. We can stick that in there, too. Lovely. Jeez, we're getting lots of lots of different shields, aren't we? And we'll stick that in there. Right, so we've got a couple of free inventory slots now. Oh, I can maybe move some of my other stuff into here as well. It's funny, you can't select that box... Oh, you can just press triangle on them. I can't select the box when I've got the fishing rod in my hand. It's very odd. Okay. Have I got more fish inside of my starship? I have. So let's move these over as well. Sweet. And then I should be able to mm, jump out of there. Put them inside of these storage boxes, and then I've got a lot of free inventory, haven't I? <clears throat> okay. There we go. Just press triangle on them. That's a lot easier. It'd still be nice if there was a transfer rule button. Okie doke. Right. Expedition. And there's a phase over here that I popped by accident, which was collect free fish at night or nocturnal fish or something. Sweet, we've got a new build part. 
Okay, cool. Okay, so what's next on the old roster of things to do? Let's have a look, see. Expedition 3. Dredge up the message of the angler, which we was about to do. And we've taken our bait off. Let's just cast out and let's see if we get one. Now, sometimes I still manage to catch a fish with no bait. Yeah, little scutterfish, and that's probably about it. But let's, uh, let's see. Let's see if we get lucky first time and get a bottle. We might get a boot. I got a boot once as well, didn't I? I can see the line now, which is a bit better. There we go. And then this is just dredging. Yeah, I got a little little frost trout, apparently. we just carry on then until I get, a, get something. I'll let you know when I get a bottle. I got another old welly boot, people. Another old welly boot, but um, yeah, a bit of flotsam. Yeah, let's carry on. It all counts to the freaking catalogue, though, doesn't it? Yeah, cool, yeah. Well, would you look at that? That's actually another welly boot. I've now got to left and right. I've got a whole freaking pair of welly boots. Okay. <laughs> okay, cool, yeah. Hooray and hurrah! I've got my message in a bottle. Let's send an SOS to the world. Okay, cool. Unseal. Okay, cool. Okay, there was some, this one doesn't have a portal code. You must leave this place. The walls close in. We should have listened when they warned us. What the flying fudge is going on? Have I not popped this one? I haven't. Oh, there we go. I saw it in my dreams last night. Scales like fire and eyes pure starlight. It sang to me a song of hope. Longing it wanted me to find it. I know it. It must be closing in. Okay. Interesting. We've got a few of these messages in a bottle now. They're taking up a lot of my inventory. I might have to go squirrel right away on my freighter at some point. Anyway. Back to these boxes. There we go. Lovely. Look, I can't interact with them with the rod in my hand, and that seems to be a little bit weird. You have to change to your multi-tool to interact with your boxes. Very odd. Anyway, we'll stick all those into there, and at some point I'll probably go sell all these. I know that there's a badge later on to sell a load of fish or something, but I don't know who to sell them to. Right, here we go. Let's go collect that one then. Done. Oh, coolio. I've already learnt this because I had a load of um, salvage data with me, so I unlocked a few. Oh, I unlocked the actual blueprint earlier. There we go. We've got that. Sweet. Automated trap plans. Oxygen 750s. So I've already got some of these automated traps, which is cool. Child of the Sea. Establish an underwater base. Okie dokie. I bet I can't do it right here, because I bet there's other people that go... I don't really want to build a base here, to be honest. I don't want to be on anywhere near a mission marker. So let's just take off. Let's just fly somewhere else. I'm not going to go too far, but I'm, I'm going to go far enough where I'm not going to interfere with other people. So let's head on over this way somewhat. I mean, there's another freaking comms ball there, isn't there? Tell you what, let's just head up through the clouds. Up! Through the atmosphere, up where the air is clear, and send it soaring. I guess. I know. Voice of an angel. Right. We head to this cluster of islands over here. My ship is so freaking heavy. I head down here. I like the look of these little group of islands here. It's like a frozen Philippines. Okay, right. Yeah, that's a do. It's probably far enough away from man and beast. Sweet. This is where I will call my new home. Man, probably not up there actually, because I need to use my jetpack to get up here. This will do. This will do. And it's even got a save point already on there for me. Isn't that wonderful? Yes. We can jump on out. I can hit that and get ourselves a freebie. Because everyone likes a freebie. Heck yes, they do. Righto. Base computer. Lovely. Hit that up. And uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's claim that base. Zoom and done. Lovely and a Lovely Japalay. Ah, 
got. And now we can build our underwater basin. Underwater basin. Okay, right. Enter into the build menu. Lovely, lovely. And underwater basin. Where's the underwater parts? They did give me the underwater parts, didn't they? Deep water, there we go. I don't really want to put it right on the ground. Can I... I want to put it slightly higher than on the freaking ground. There we go. That'll do. Let's put it up nearer to the surface so I can stand on its roof. There we go. Uh, do, did they give me the moon door? They freaking did. Oh, you beauties. There we go. We'll stick that on the bottom. And it's saying that I can't build it, so I'm going to use my little wire placey technique like that. Stick it there. And when I delete it, it should give me all the parts back. Okay, now let's um now let's construct it there. Boom! There we go. We've got our moon door there. Next off, what do I want to put on here as well? Um, probably a little power room or something coming off of it would be nice, wouldn't it? So yeah, let's let's put on a little glass corridor over there. And then what we'll do is we'll stick that on for power. Doesn't matter, that hasn't got no... And uh, I could do with a door on this thing, couldn't I? I know I've got... I know I've got myself... Uh-oh, I think I'm drowning. Let's just get inside. Let me in. There we go. Head on over here, and then I can put in all my power thingies. Power thingies! Oh, great. I haven't actually got the solar panels, so not many power thingies. I can put one of these in, I suppose. There you go. I had to glitch that in, and then I can place one in. And I can put down a battery, hopefully. No, I can't, so glitch that in. Delete it. Place it. There we go. And I might have to put in one extra one of these. Stick that there. Okay, now I could do getting some solar panels in here, but for now, this would probably give me enough power anyway if I do need power. And I could probably do with a teleporter. I don't know whether I've actually... Oh, we have got a teleporter. I'll delete that. Place it properly. There we go. Cool. And if I get solar panels, I'll put them all over here. But to get solar panels, I'm going to need some more of that salvage data. Right, anyway, hopefully this is enough of a base to actually, you know, start uploading. I wonder if I can put my new decals on the freaking wall. Uh, there we go. Let's put these on the wall. Oh, can't blink and see them. That's that's useful, isn't it? What's the point in having decals if you can't see them on the wall? Okay, um, let's try stacking them. So if I put one there, another one, now I can see it. So I have to put down three before I can see my poster. All right, well, there's three posters there. I'm, I'm not going to do that forever and a day. All right, we've just got one poster. Lovely. It's a bit fishy. All right, let's uh, head on up to my base computer and let's get it uploaded then, shall we? Let's see if I can upload it anyway. Hopefully I can. Uh, yeah. Well, that's, that's the only real base. There we go. I do. Has that worked? Establish an underwater base. Base. Well, I, I have. Reach a depth of 30 U's to begin. Currently zero U's. Oh, for fudge sake. Okay, I didn't read that bit, did I? All right, well, I'm going to go do that again, but 30 U's under the water, okay? And right, I'll see you in a bit after I've built it. But you get the basic premise of what I'm building. Chums, as I was swimming to get to 30 U's under the water, I come across a creature. It was a shark. And I scanned it. That guy over there. I scanned that guy. And it just popped another badge. I, I wasn't meaning to. It just freaking happened. I thought, oh, he's nice. I'm going to scan him. I scanned it. Boom. Popped. And it's on this planet in the rendezvous area, the cold planet. Well, there we go. How cool was that? I was going to guess it is worth scanning a few fish then. I didn't realise there was a badge for that, so I am sorry. Right, let's uh, try and get a little bit deeper. Yes, this is fun. Okay, well I've just built a little igloo under the sea, and that seems to have worked. I'm just going to put in the uh, teleporter and all that sort of shenanigans like I had before anyway, people. 
Okay, I've got to go for a weird angle, have I? All right, fine. No, it's not letting me. All right, I'll reconvene in a bit. Okay, chums, I've actually built three little catchers here as well. So, like, three little um, pots here to catch fish with. And I'll just swim back up here a bit. La, 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 la. Come on. I'll show you my pots. If you build them on the surface of the water, they actually float to the top. So, I've got three little pots up here somewhere. But anyway, I'm going to swim back down to my base, and I'm going to use the teleporter to teleport back to my other base where I've got some more of those pots, because there is a badge called the Lazy Fisherman. So here we go, let's go into here. Lovely. Head on over here. Add a little bit of carbon into here, and it should, I'm hoping, power this into action. There we go. And I can teleport back to one of my other bases where I've got some pots. So your bases and i'm not too sure where i blink and put them current system is saying that i've got two bases in this system i deleted the other base didn't i okay well is it on a different planet then or something oh it's on the nuclear planet it must be that one we'll go there quickly and we'll have a look i need to rename these okay so we've arrived let's um let's uh let's just rename this Okay, and I'll call it Nuke. Three pots. There you go. That'll do. And. Oh. It's too small to upload, apparently. That'll do anyway. Okay, let's interact with this one. Let's see how many fish we've got here. Oh, we've got a fair old catch, people. There we are. Grab those. I think you've got to catch 15. Well, this has been here for nearly. Well, I, I fell asleep. It's been all night. Oh, my days. They're not all that great at catching, are they? Yeah, uh, we go. Let's grab this one then. I'm going to get my inventory quite full quite quickly doing this. Bloody heck. Okay, and this one. Come on! Oh, that's a big one. I, I, would, I would have thought these would have just catched greens, but that, that was a nice blue, that one. Okay, right. There you go, the lazy fisherman. We've caught a load. Done. I guess. Okay, so go back over to expedition. And the lazy fisherman is that one. Inventory full. Yes. No wonder. I'd have put out my skiff again. Skiffity skiff, and we'll stick all the fish in. Okay, um, that didn't quite work, did it? All right, let's let's try that again. Yeah, I just need your boxes, mate. Just hold still for five seconds while I stick some fish in you. All right, here we go. Mental. And you can't change to your ship inventory from here, can you? So. Have I got any fish in my... Uh, yeah, look, I've got loads of my freaking starship as well. I tell you what, as good as this expedition has been, the worst part, by far, has been managing the storage of your freaking fish. Okay, here we go. I mean, when I do want to come and sell these, I've got to find somewhere where I can deploy my skiff to do it. Unless I can put some sort of galactic trade terminal at a base right here and then just sell them straight away, which would be the ideal method. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm melting, mate. I'm freaking melting. My freaking trying to scuttle off fish. Okay. Put that in there. Let's put these in here and get them in. Okay. We've got quite a lot of fish. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see if I can now pop this badge. Yes, I can. Sweet. And now we've got to go and catch five icy cold fish. And I've only caught one. So I need to get back to where I was. So here we go. Let's let's make this base big enough to upload then, shall we? And I'll be right back with you. Okay, right. Well, I'm back on my icy planet and I'm by my little pods. Let's see if they've caught anything. I don't think they've been going long enough to catch anything, to be honest. No, they haven't. Okay, I was hoping I could get lucky. Right, okay. 
My skip is very skippy though. I can hardly stand on the dang thing. Look at it. It's like a freaking roller coaster. I think it's because I've put it directly above my base. Let's swim over here just a little bit. Let's um let's redeploy my skiff here. Fun times. Okay, here we go. No. Yeah, I know this. Must deploy on water. Well, I've tried that. Look, it's over here. But standing on it is freaking dubious. All right, fine. We, we go with that. Okay, fine. Okay, let's start fishing then, shall we? Before my skiff goes skiffy. And let's uh, put on some bait. Uh, put on maybe this one. Let's try that. Okay. Let's get my fishing rod. And let's start fishing. Blop. Okay. Time to catch some fish, people. I'll let you know when I've caught a, a frozen one and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, something I've noticed, chums, is the bait that I put in there attracts storm-loving fish, which I, I don't want to be using. Now, one of the actual rewards I got is some deftly cold ice cream. It's highly valuable, but I'm wondering if that might attract some cold fish. Attracts jorial fish. All right, well, we would cast that out anyway. I think they're going to eat it before it actually manages to catch me a fish, but we'll give that a go anyway. I was, I was wondering whether there might be some bait that might attract cold fish. The trouble is, is you're not, it's not common fish. It's not the green ones we want to catch. We want to catch ourselves. Oh, no, I've lost my bait. OK, all right, fine. Let's uh, rebait this up. Yeah, I want to catch uncommon, uncommon fish. So I think this one ups the rarity chance. Yeah, rarity chance, chance by 54. we we'll go with that. Hopefully we get a few uncommons now, okay? A few blue ones at the very least, anyhow. Go! All right, leave it with me, people. This could take a while. Okay, so we've got this one, a medium size, and it's uncommon. The only thing is, it says that it's found across multiple habitats uh, in, the, in the galaxy. It's not a frozen fish. So although it was an uncommon, I got super excited. It's not the fish we're after. Okay, well, this is a rare catch, so one up, one common. And it's also found on icy planets. Let's see if that counts. It has counted. So as long as it's rarer than uncommon, it also counts. That's cool. OK, back at it. I've been at this for a while now, people. This is not an easy milestone. As I say that, I just cast it straight back out. I caught another one, almost identical. Brilliant. So that's now three of five. There we go. Okay, brine skipper, medium sized aquatic creature. That's uncommon. That should count, right? Let's have a look. Yes, I'm now on four of five. Brilliante. Heck yeah. Okay, this one is also uncommon, also frozen. Giant ice fin. Sweet. And I think that's us done. Freaking is, mate. I guess. Well, that one was a little bit more tedious. So here we go. No, oh, I can't actually. Inventory's full. Well, I'll tell you why that is. I've been... You'll see just how many freaking fish I caught before I managed to complete this. So all of these are going over right now. And I bet you there's a shed ton more in my freaking starship. I bet you. Yeah. Yeah, look. There's all these as well. I'm going to have to do two trips again to get them all in the bring an ice box but you can see just how many i had to catch it, it, there was a lot there was a lot of fish catching that went on there people boom put all those over and yeah i have to do two trips for this okay here we go put these over or oh, might have to do another one you know what you've seen me put stuff in ice boxes before I've got one left here yeah i'll reconvene in a bit Okay, right, well, I've claimdicated that badge now, which was that one. So now I can claim this. We're going to get the DC helmet and sea armor. So I can head back on up to the uh, Spatial Anomaly, and um, we can go adorn that. So I'll see you up at the Spatial Anomaly. I'm looking for my ship right now, and I'm not being able to spy it with my eye peepers anywhere. Okay, right, let's, uh, let's see if I can call it in. Yeah, we'll put it there. Sweet, I'll see you up in the Spatial Anomaly.
Okie pokey, dilly dokey. That's a good one in then. Head. And we got this one here. Oh, snaz. Okay, stick that on. We got red, white, and black. You know what? Well, that, 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 that actually looks okay. And then the armor. Let's go into the armor. And we've got the new armor as well. Deep sea armor. Oh, sweet. I think I liked it a little bit more before. It's got blue on there for some reason. Let's, let's go red. Oh, very nice. What about red again? Yes, I'm liking that. I don't know where it's picking up the white from because there's all red all across the board there. I think that's slightly broken, but I don't really care. That looks good. Holy mackerel. I look like a deep sea diver, apart from the uh, jetpack, which this one happens to be my favourite jetpack. But I wouldn't mind seeing the new one that we're, we're unlocking, people. Pretty darn freaking epic and cool. Right, so let's head on over to my starship. And I think that's that's pretty much that phase done, isn't it? Hopefully you're playing along at home. Hopefully you're having the same sort of amount of luck or bad luck as I'm having. Whichever way, let us know in the comments how you're getting on, people. I had a few people hit me up on Phase 2 saying I can't wait until you do Phase 3 because I am stuck catching the ice fish. I used the Spiced Chum as a bait. Now, the Spiced Chum I actually put into the console to take on this expedition with me. Can I actually craft it? I can. It's right there. You need more diet, phosphorus and dehydrogen. Yeah, to actually craft that, which... We've been to a few planets that have that on, but more that you get from killing creatures, phosphorus you get on the hot planets, and the dehydrogen of the little blue crystals. So you should be able to craft your own spiced chum. That ups the chance of a rarer catch by about what, 30 or 40% or something mental like that. So that's how I caught my iced fish, people. Anyway, salute to Mondo, and um, I'll see you next time for the next episode. Until then, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Yeah,